What's going on guys, Kaibox here and Mikachi. We have a, uh, a Luma Crate to unbox for you guys. Uh, this is one of our favorite book boxes that we get. And um, high expectations. So it's kind of bad because it's like, if it's not good, then we're like, Ugh, this one sucked, you know? But uh, it's also really expensive. So we did pay for it out of pocket. It wasn't sent so these out to are, us. this book box is set in set in. It originates in the UK. Um, to, so to ship it here, it's like fifteen to twenty bucks. So this box goes for about I think sixty dollars US dollars, maybe a little more, like sixty four, sixty five. What's the shipping? That's with the shipping. Oh, okay, okay. Um, Jeez. I was about to change my mind on so, that one. I was about to say, never mind. Yeah. Don't get that one anymore. <laughs> So we've been a little underwhelmed with other book boxes lately. So I have like high expectations for this, which might be bad. Mm. But um, also, I always, when I buy like special edition boxes of like books coming out uh, that I'm really looking forward to, like I pretty much always get them from Illumicrate. So I have a Dark Dawn coming in later on in the year when that releases in September. Um, I'm really excited about that. So... Illumicrate's one of my favorites for like special editions and they're just one of my favorites in general. So I have high expectations, which might be bad. This book, they spoiled it like literally um, in their advertisement for this box. We know that it's Aurora rising in here. I can't say that word. This is a lot of packaging. No, this is part of, it's that, it's it's the snake, look. <laughs> it's the, the cardboard snake that they include with all their shippings. Try to guess what it is first. The... The item, a yes. lunchbox. Ooh, that's a. I would have never guessed that. Oh, it is a lunchbox. It is a lunchbox. I told you, dude. That was a good guess. I would have never guessed that. Oh, is this from Aurora, Aurora Rising? Rising? I All think right. it is. I like that. I'll use this. I bring a lunchbox to work every day. I like. It almost looks holographic. I don't think it is. I think it's. Just I don't know. I don't like think it is. Shiny material. It's just like the. Oh, it might be this coming through. The weird shiny material. Yeah, it looks cool. But it almost looks holographic. It's just a bunch of uh, lady faces. Squad 312. 9-9. Nine, nine. It is all the women, though. I, I, I don't already know. said that. that that's from, that's I already from. said that. Why do you have to, like, make hey, it seem... Hey, look Whoa, at this sexy this? man. What is this, anime? It is cool. What is it, though? It's a pouch. Oh, it's got one of those... I like those pinchy pouches. But what is it? Squad 312. This is them again? They're all, I think everything in this box is Aurora Rising. Oh, cool. I don't see any of the same people on here. This is a different artist. There's no official, like, artwork for this. So he's like a sexy space elf. Sexy space elf? Cool. Yeah. And what about this guy with he's the black eyes? He's a different um, race also. I don't remember what he's called. Oh, the rest human? Yeah, I think so. They're taking a selfie. Are they really? Yeah, oh what, God, do, you, what cool. do you think they're doing? That's fun. Do they take selfies in the book? What do you put in here, though? Glasses? Maybe put, it's a glasses You put case. whatever you want in Sunglasses. here. Sunglasses. I'm calling it. Where's the thing? Do you get a sampler for the Furies? You'd kill to be the one Furies? of them. The Furies? The Furies. The Furies. The Furies. The Furies. Exclusive sampler. Witches, murder, and teenage girls. This is the book of my dreams. I am obsessed. Obsession, witchcraft, Can we move this, and murder. Please? What'd you say? Uh... Obsession, Witchcraft, and Murder. I think I've heard of this book, but I don't know when it comes out. It doesn't even say. This this box is all about the ladies. I'm I'm cool with and it. You just got all the ladies on on the covers. There's of stuff. men right here. Yeah, but, but like the other stuff I get. But they're kind of like girly men. That would make them so sexy. Can't English. <laughs> that what make them. That what make them so sexy. <laughs> yes. What a nice. All right. All right. All right. Oh, is that... So we have a print. Oh, it's a letter from the authors. That's cool. A letter. Here's a spoiler card. A letter, a letter, a letter, a letter. Oh, let me cover that. Move that. I hope you guys can read that. Did you like this book? Uh, I think I gave it a 3, 3.5. So no. I like it. It's not my favorite, but it's good. Now I have three copies of it, so I better like it. Oh, that's her. She's How come she's not on here? I don't know. All right, so this is next month's uh, description for what's going on. You guys probably cannot read that, but uh, you know, just go to their website and, and check out what's coming out yeah, next I don't, month. If you sign up now, I'm not sure if we would get that box or the next box, but 
Items are useful items, perfect for any book lover. Nothing will be fandom specific. It will only include gorgeously designed, practical things that all book lovers need in their life. All right, so next month is um, not gonna be any sort of fandom stuff. It's just gonna be random, how, read it again. Gorgeously designed, practical things that all book lovers need in their lives. I'm not feeling that. I like I'm it. Sorry. I, I it might be cool. It might. It probably will not be. I'm actually okay. So ready? To this book. It's just gonna come with a lunchbox. <laughs> so this hardback, it's gonna come with a hardback with exclusive sprayed ev edges and a signed book plate. Paperback will have rainbow sprayed edges. That sounds really cool. Just saying. So it's coming with two books. Yeah. Anything else in the box? Another book sampler. Meet Emily. She can solve advanced advanced mathematical problems, unlock the mind's deepest secrets, and even fix your truck's air con. But can she save the world? Condition they make. Oh, air con. Emily Eternal. Is that the name of the book? I've never heard of this. It is. Oh, yeah. By M.G. Wheaton. Emily is an artificial consciousness designed in a lab to help humans process trauma, which is particularly helpful when the sun begins to die five billion years five billion years before scientists agree it was supposed to. So her beloved human race is screwed, and so is Emily. That is, until she finds a potential answer buried deep in the human genome. But before her solution can be tested, her lab is brutally attacked, and Emily is forced to go on the run with two human companions college student Jason and small town sheriff Myra. That sounds cool. I think it's it sounds unique, interesting. Yeah. I've never I would, heard of I'd it. I'd be down for reading it. I, at first I was like, oh, that's going to be stupid. Like the beginning of the, yeah. the synapse. And I was just like, oh, wait. This, it sounds cool. This is interesting. Ooh, look at these cute stickies. You got a little baby sticky notes. It's cute. Ooh, you're cute. <laughs> Thanks. What the heck is this? That's a uh, bookmark. Is it? A money clip? Is it a little note? It's a little notepad. Oh. Luggage tag. What? That doesn't make any sense. I guess it makes sense because like you just have your information in there, and if somebody finds it... I like it, the design. But how do they get it out? They have to bend this? And they have to open it, because you have to put this thing in there to put it on your luggage. How the heck does this work? It looks Because it's cool. like, see, it's metal, it's aluminum, anodized aluminum, right? And you write your, you write your stuff in here, and then you stick it in there and you clip it to your thing but how are people if they i guess it would only be like if they find it then they could just rip this open yeah. and do it but it would take them like damaging the crap out of it to figure out how to get it open yeah they'd be like what the hell is this you know like, like but i guess this is like a unique enough thing to hang off your bag to know that it's yours i like it you know i like it i like it i like it a lot oh no oh no what is this one of those things tapestry no i don't like tapestries or a pillowcase. Please let it be a pillowcase. Oh, it's a regular pillowcase. All right, I'm down for that. Oh, look at it. It's pretty cool, too. It's like they're floating around in space, space, space. Let me space. see. It has a back, too. Dude, that's cool. Who are they? I like the art. Who I are have, they? I think it... Well, this may spoil the book a bit. Um... If it's the characters I'm thinking of, it should be Aurora and... Why is her hair different? That's what I'm saying, though. Like, there do, there were two people in space that kind of, like, had to go through space really quickly before they, like, died. Well, no, we don't know that they're floating through space. So this is just a space uh, thing. But is that supposed there. to be Aurora? Because she has red hair. No, I, but none of... One of them has red hair-ish. Um, her name, I can't remember her name, but there is a character. This is cool. We never got a, a regular size pillow, a bed pillowcase. I we, like that. We've only gotten like couch pillowcases. I wonder though, can you wash it? Does it say stuff? What does it say on it? Oh, goodness gracious. The only, the only way... way will 
it, it will, will remember you as if you do something worthy of remembrance. Um, the universe has already given you everything after all. It was here long before you, and it will go on long after you. Sweet. I wonder if you could wash it. What time is it? Ten. Ooh. What is that, a pin? This box has a lot of stuff in is it. Is that a pin? No, a magnet? Oh, but it's metal. But it's like a pin with a, ma it's a magnet pin. It's like an enamel magnet. You know, like an enamel pin, but instead of having the pin on the back, it's a magnet. It looks nice. Did you really? <laughs> you just read it. It wasn't opening, all right? It's really cool looking. Is she supposed to have red hair? No. Maybe people don't know what they're making when they make these. There I mean, is a character we've with known, red hair. We've known the cover for like ever. But there is a character with red hair. I think it's red. I really like this. You want to keep it? Where would you put no, it? No, 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 no. I'm just thinking like we should make these. I just want, I, oh, I don't want pins. I just oh, want like oh. coins. How cool would it be to have like a coin? Cool. What the hell oh, is that? Oh, it's for the that? luggage. Oh. Okay, there it is. And now you can't get to your thing. You literally wouldn't be able to read the thing at all. I'm so confused on what the thought process was for this. I like it though. It's neat looking. No, it's, yeah, but it's like, it's not usable. It's not practical. Talk about practical things. Is this their like logo, the little fox or something? I don't know. Do they have a fox thing? Not that I, I don't know. I don't remember. Cool. It's cool. It's a cool item, but it, it practically doesn't make sense. And now the exclusive book with pink. Oh, the cover's different too. Edges. Yeah, it's pink instead of uh, purple. purple. It's damaged a little bit. Mm. Mm. It's damaged the I good. I don't know if it's enough to care and make them ship me a new one from England. It's damaged the good a bit. Hold on. The book itself isn't. It's just the the paper. At least based on what, just first glance. But it is an exclusive paper, so you, it's not like I could just go buy another copy of the book. And you have another there. copy of the book. True. Do you only have one other copy of the book? You have two other copies of not the book. Not yet. One's coming in. Why? Because it has purple edges. You, you didn't even like the book. I like it. You gave it a three and a half. That is not liking it. That's just saying that, remember what you said about threes? They're eh. It's got pink inside papers, too. I don't think the regular one has that. So thank you guys for watching. Is that all that's in the box, Meek? Yeah, it's a lot. Um, it is. So that's one advantage of these Aluma crates is that they come with a bunch of junk. Oh, wait, let's see what... You know, okay. which, which we're not saying junk isn't bad, but it's just like a bunch of crap, for lack of a better word. Crap is a good thing, right? A good way to say it. Hey. Is junk better than crap? So this is a cooler bag. Oh, these are the women from the Lunar Chronicles. Oh. It's not Aurora Rising. We were wrong. That makes sense because I don't see anybody with the little, the, the rogue hair. Um, The pillowcase. Oh, so this is not from Aurora Rising. I was completely wrong about this box. This is from, which totally makes sense. It's from Illumin Illumine. Uh, because this is how all the writing in that, uh, or, they had these swirls in writing in those books. Oh. So these are, it's Katie and uh, Ezra. Ezra Miller? Katie and Ezra from Illuminae. I know, I know, Illuminae. I remember that all book. All right, all right. This is Howler luggage tag from uh, Red Rising. Did you read that? Yes, I didn't like it. But the, the tag is cool. But it doesn't make sense. Like, how do you... You can't even open this. Yeah, I know. And you can't even... See. You I was can't, like, It's stuck on here. Yeah, no, I was like, wow, is, did they think about this? It, they didn't. They didn't think about it at all. It's so dumb. It's cool, but it's so dumb as the thing it's supposed to be. The thing is cool, but the thing that it's supposed... It's like, it's like if I did this, ready? I made a book. Look at how interesting it is but I glued all the pages together. So you can't read it, but it's a book. The cover looks cool, right? Like imagine if all these sprayed edges were just glued together. You got a sprayed edge book, you just can't read it ever. Hmm. I can't believe I was so wrong about this entire box being like totally Aurora wow. Rising related. I'm not surprised at all I knowing know. you. So this is a Squad 312 pouch. First, 
Featuring... I mean, we knew that because it says Squad 312 on the back. Featuring the cast of Aurora rising in their very first selfie. Use this patch pouch to store your phone, your sunglasses, or glasses, or whatever else you can think of. Smell this. The chemical. <laughs> so strong. Space sticky notes designed by Fable and Black. Um, I like to call them spacey notes. Magnetic coin. Oh. I love that coin idea. That's so great. So it's Katie Grant from Illuminae. That should have given it away because it had error written all over it. Error. Yeah. You got a lot of stuff. I like it. What's your favorite? Probably the pillowcase. The pillowcase is cool, yeah. I, I, this is my favorite. Just <laughs> because, because you love to so it. It's so stupid. Like, it's like whoever came up with this is so dumb. Like, I'm sorry, but it's like awesome and dumb at the same time. Unless I'm missing something. And if I'm missing something, please explain it to me. But if we write something in there, we then have to take the belt off to be able to slide the paper out. Is that a normal thing? Like, to have to take the whole thing apart? Like, is, that's not normal. It makes no sense. But this is my favorite. That's my pillowcase, right? No. Can I at least have a pillow? Yeah. <laughs> Cats threw up on my pillow the other day. So I've been um, no pillow. That's no a lie. You have one pillow because you're a weirdo that has two pillows. I've been no bi no pillow bill for like he's been for like one a week now. pillow bill. One pillow bill for a week now, and uh, it sucks only having one pillow. You try to prop your neck up so that you like you know you can support yourself and like see things. It works. Being fine. one pillow bill is no fun. That's all I'm saying. I have to wash your pillow, okay? Um. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys were entertained. And uh, leave a comment down below letting us know what your favorite thing was. Mine was that dumb fox thing. Uh, yours was the pillowcase. And uh, in that comment, we would love to, to see you guys prove that you stayed, stayed with us this far. And uh, include the word... Lion. Lion. Like you lion? No. Like or like rawr. Or could it be both one? Both of them? No. All right. Like rawr. <laughs> If you like this video, make sure to um, smash that like button or just hit it or just give it a little bump of your hip, a hip, hip bump. I'm trying to hit you, but it's not going to work. And um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. Say bye, Meek. <laughs> bye, Meek. Bye, bye, bye. <laughs>